Hi, my name is Ajay Pidyarthi. I'm a director at uh, Black Coffer OPC Private uh, Limited. I'm operating from New Delhi, India. This video, uh, in this video, I will uh, walk through an important uh, proof of concept and the software that uh, we have made. Uh, that is uh, Google LSA API to Google BigQuery to Google Data Studio with a complete automation. So basically this software operates and automates data from uh, Google LSA uh, using API to Google BigQuery database. And further, the, the, the database is connected to the Google Data Studio for uh, dashboarding and business intelligence purpose. Uh, the steps involves uh, getting data from LSA API, then uh, once you have access uh, of the LSA data, then connect your data to the database where you would like to store. For example, Google BigQuery or Google Sheets or anywhere that you uh, feel comfortable with the database that you can own. Then uh, once data uh, base is connected with uh, the LSA API, uh, you can perform several matrices that you would like to track and perform and visualize in the Google Data Studio. And then um, the last step involves linking the data set to your favorite uh, BI tool, for example, Google Data Studio. Uh, here are the detailed uh, discussions and the steps that involves how uh, we are able to get data from Google LSA using API, uh, available APIs. Uh, the entire code and the code base that we have made, they are basically completely available in Python. So this uh, step in, uh, talks about uh, connecting data uh, through Google LSA API using Python and then uh, using the Python script itself, uh, connect uh, your data to your database. And uh, once database is connected, then with, uh, the other options are basically you can also connect to uh, Google Excel sheet or save the data into CSV or Excel file wherever you like. And uh, believe me, the LSA API gives us the historical data. Um, uh, for the complete automations here, uh, you can see that you have made two Python scripts. One is uh, uh, connecting data from LSA API. That is the one. Second is sending the data to the Google uh, BigQuery platform or a database or wherever you like. So for complete automation, you will need to deploy the Python script as a microservice uh, or as a cron job uh, into a server that you are using, for example, Heroku or Google Functions, whichever basically uh, you are comfortable in deploying python code as a uh, as a function or uh, as a as a microservice you are free to use anything that you love um so uh, like the entire code base etc with including this documentation i have uploaded to this uh, uh, github code this is a private uh, repository you can you can uh, request me anytime you want uh, i'm uh, uh, always available uh, for a call or contacts you can connect me uh, via my email or Skype or my WhatsApp number. I'll be more than happy to uh, assist and uh, uh, provide you better uh, uh, approach or complete automation with the complete BI uh, dashboards that can help you to uh, that can help you to decide uh, your marketing strategies, business strategies, and uh, and further more intuitive insights that you can drive and act upon from the data available at MCC Google LSA uh, local service ads platforms. Um, I'll stop uh, this discussion uh, with uh, 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 with the detail that I have uh, shared now and feel free to reach me on a given contact detail uh, so that uh, I can be of more helpful. Thank you. Thank you so much uh, for watching this video. Uh, stay connected with us. Thank you.